For those looking to make money in an easily accessible way, apps provide plenty of avenues to consider. You can use your smartphone to take surveys, pick up a side gig, sell your unwanted stuff and more. Here's the scoop on 7 free money-making apps. NerdWallet considered apps with at least 4 stars and 25,000 reviews in both Google Play and the iOS App Store. 1. Ibotta How It Works. Ibotta lets you earn cash back on in-store and online purchases at over 2,000 supported retailers. Originally for groceries, it has expanded to include clothing, entertainment and eating out, pet supplies and other categories. Offers can be product or retailer specific, and some will automatically be applied. For others, you'll need to complete an additional task such as watching a video or taking a poll. There are three possible ways to earn cash back in stores. Add offers and submit your receipt in the app after your shopping trip, link your retailer loyalty accounts or purchase a retailer gift card through the Ibotta app. For online purchases, you shop through the app or with the Ibotta browser extension on your computer. Payment. PayPal, digital gift card or direct to a bank account. Pros. You'll receive cash back on in-store purchases quickly, typically within 24 hours. Ibotta also offers a welcome bonus to new users, referral bonuses and a variety of payment methods. Cons. Making money can be a slow process. You must have at least $20 in cash back to redeem your earnings, some gift cards require at least $25 in earnings. For online shopping, the pending period for earning cash back varies by retailer. 2. Rakuten How It Works. Rakuten, formerly known as Ebates, rewards shoppers with up to 40% cash back on purchases from well-known retailers, restaurants and food delivery services. Users can also earn cash back on travel, gift cards and more. It's straightforward. Create an account, tap on the store where you want to shop in the app, then make the transaction through the portal. You can also link a credit or debit card to your Rakuten account to earn cash back in store as long as you activate the deal through the app first. Rakuten credits the cash back to your account after it confirms the purchase with the retailer, which it says can take a few hours to several days. Payment. PayPal or check. Pros. Thousands of stores and purchases are eligible for cash back, so you'll likely find deals where you already shop. New users can earn a $10 welcome bonus after their first qualified purchase. You can also earn sign-up and referral bonuses. Cons. As with most cash back services, you have to spend money to make money. You won't see your earnings right away, either, Rakuten sends out payments every three months, and you need at least a $5 cash back balance to get paid. 3. Swagbucks How It Works. Swagbucks is a cash back and rewards app. You earn points, called, SB, by shopping, taking polls, watching videos, playing games or fulfilling other tasks through Swagbucks. You can redeem those points for gift cards or get cash back to your PayPal account. The total points awarded can vary by task. For example, surveys are typically worth about 40 to 200 SB points each. The minimum balance required to redeem depends on the payout option you choose, but some gift cards are available for as low as 110 SB. Payment. Gift card or PayPal. Pros. Swagbucks offers many easy ways to earn rewards, and there's no waiting period to cash in. Payments usually arrive within 10 business days after redemption. You can also get a $10 bonus with a qualifying $25 purchase when you join. Cons. It doesn't pay much. 1 SB is worth about a cent. With many tasks valued at pennies, it can take a fair amount of time and effort to make substantial money. Additionally, you won't qualify for every survey or task. Users often report getting kicked out of surveys in the middle of taking them. This can be due to demographics or dishonest or inconsistent answers, according to Swagbucks. 4. Fiverr How It Works. Fiverr is a freelancing marketplace that features gigs in over 200 categories, such as programming and video and animation. Create an account first, then you can set your profile as a seller, highlighting your expertise. Post the gig you're offering, which will include pricing and a description of your services. Clients, known as, buyers, can click through and place orders. Why Owl get paid once you complete the job? Fiverr assigns seller levels based on performance. As you move up each tier, you'll be able to sell more, extras, such as a faster delivery time. Payment. PayPal, 
direct to a bank account or credit to a fiber revenue card, a prepaid card. Minimum withdrawal amounts vary, and you may be charged a withdrawal fee, depending on which option you choose. Pros. You don't have to worry about tracking down buyers because they come to you. You can also earn tips. Cons. Fiverr takes 20% of your earnings for every gig, including tips, and there's a standard 14-day waiting period to withdraw money after completing an order. Top-tier sellers wait 7 days for funds to clear. 5. Upwork How It Works. Upwork connects freelancers to gigs in writing, design, marketing and other categories on the marketplace. First, you'll create a profile. It should include information such as the field you're interested in plus your qualifications, availability and desired rate. Then, you can submit proposals. Clients will review them and offer projects if you seem like a good fit. You begin each month with a set number of connects, which are like credits that allow you to contact prospective clients. You can earn or pay a small sum for more connects, but you won't be charged when clients contact you. You can get paid on an hourly or per project basis. Payment. Direct to U.S. Bank. Direct to your bank account. Wire transfer. Instant pay. PayPal and Payoneer. Charges apply to some payment options, so be sure to check Upwork for details. Pros. Upwork helps take the work out of seeking out clients, establishing relationships and getting paid. The service also gives you the flexibility to set your preferred rate and schedule. Cons. The app is free to download, but initiating contact with lots of clients costs money. Users also get charged a service fee. Upwork takes a 5% to 20% cut of your earnings based on how much you've billed a client. The more you earn, the more you get to keep. However, you won't get paid until 10 days after the billing period ends. Remember, too, that you're competing with other freelancers on the platform. That means clients may choose those who've set lower rates.